Hello, welcome back to Paul's Beer Reviews. Um, something a little bit different now. Um, some of you may be aware that the last kind of 18 months or so, I've had a little kind of project going on behind the scenes and I've been busy making uh, a beer cap tabletop. Uh, I mentioned it to one or two of my subscribers and it's been taking a while because we've got work and other things going on. So it's kind of been put on the back burner for a little while. So we've been doing bits to it here and there for the last sort of 18 months or so. Um, I can now finally say it's done. It's here. And what I'm going to do now via the wonders of technology, I'm going to shoot us back about 12 months <laughs> to when I first, we'd made the table. And then what we were doing, we were kind of getting all the bottle caps out, having to cut a few in half to kind of fit them in with the frame. And uh, the video, the next video you'll see is that process, putting all the caps in place. And then the video you'll see after that, is us kind of starting to glue the bottle caps in place and then I'll finish it with a video of the end product. So if you're interested in any of this crap, stay tuned and uh, enjoy the video. Cheers. So, hello, welcome back to Paul's Beer Reviews. Bit of a different one today. Uh, we're not actually drinking beer. We are making a beer cap table, okay? I'm gonna show you how we're getting on so far. And uh, yeah, so what we got, We've got loads of beer caps, as you can see, that we've been collecting for a long time. And we're now placing them on our table that we've created. We have a nice rim around the edge there, it's gonna keep it all in place. We've had to get creative and cut some halves so we can fit them in at the edges. It's gonna be quite a long drawn out process. So we're gonna see how we get on. So uh, yeah, I'll keep you updated, cheers. Okay, uh, update on the table. Um, so sort of current bundle my eyes. Um, update on the table. Here we go. So, she so looks pretty good. That's what it's gonna look like. Um, we've now got Abby here gluing all of our caps down. We're probably gonna be here for a while doing this, but that's what it's gonna look like. And we've still got plenty left over. So we're going to have to make something else with them. Um, but yeah, it's getting there. And um, I'll just give you another update soon. Right, so here is the finished product. All the bottle caps in place on me Team GB coaster. Get it out of the way. Um, if I get it down at this angle, you can kind of make out the the sort of glass finish that we created to the top there. So what we did, we used like an epoxy resin and glass cast mixture. Mixed that up, poured it all over the top. Got it as level as we could, let it set. And now we've got a, uh, a nice kind of glass top to it. Show you a quick scan over the top, the amount of different bottle caps. I have no idea how many bottle caps we used to finish this. I mean, it's well into the hundreds, probably pushing a thousand bottle caps on this thing. Um, a lot of these beers are drunk. There's a few soft ones as well in there as well. You might spot one or two Coca-Cola, Pepsi ones. There's a Pepsi one there. But the majority of different beer caps. Lots of different ones. But yes. This is my new drinking table. I'm very proud of this. And we've still got loads of bottle caps left, so we're probably going to get creative and make some more, uh, make some more bottle cap things. We're kind of talking about stall tops, aren't we, and mini tables and things like that. So, uh, yes. Yeah. What do you reckon, Abby? Love it. Love it. Simple. Simple. <laughs> so yeah, here is the bottle cap tabletop. Very pleased with that for a first crack. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed that. Till the next one, guys, you take care.